Our top story tonight, Yellowstone National Park will reopen its gates next Monday, but only the gates in Wyoming. MTN's John Shear explains why access to Yellowstone from Montana will still be off limits. Montana's Yellowstone entrances account for 70% of all the traffic into the park, but they're staying closed because of Montana's 14-day quarantine. We all have the same goals of getting the parks open. Sholly predicts that Montana is not far behind Wyoming and says staggered opening dates could actually be beneficial. Let's see what the impacts are to Cody and Jackson uh, and let's let that inform how what kind of decisions that we make uh, over the next couple weeks in regards to the gateways in Montana. Monday's reopening will include no overnight stays, very limited services, and no help for Montana businesses. The town is hurting badly. Even though Clyde Seeley's hotel in West Yellowstone is mostly empty, he has supported the travel ban. But we do have to go on living, so we need to learn how to adapt to the new normal. You know, I understand keeping some of the hot spots closed, like the Old Faithful Inn and all that, but at the very least, it lets, let people access Yellowstone. At the Bozeman Chamber of Commerce, Daryl Schlimm sees the clock ticking. I think you're going to start to see that if we don't open up and look at what uh, Wyoming and the rest of them are doing, is that it may be too late for us to be rebound and recover um, if we don't get our gates open. We still have some of the best months in front of us. And let's figure out how to safely and conservatively uh, not put ourselves in a position uh, where we're putting July, August, or September in jeopardy. Shully says he puts an enormous responsibility on the public. There's no faster way for us to go backwards than the public not being responsible when they come here to visit. Phase two of the reopening will see campgrounds, cabins, and more come online. But so far, there's no date for when that might happen. In Bozeman, John Shearer, MTN News. Governor Steve Bullock says the Montana entrances won't open until June 1st at the earliest.